Operation Torpedo. That, that, that was the name of the operation I was talking about, where 300 Spartans go to uh, basically on a suicide mission, and like they all die except for Tom and Lucy, I believe, was the other one. So I've sat on that for a week, but I finally remembered to look it up. Operation Torpedo. Last episode was kind of a doozy. Uh, not much happened outside of Riz calling it quits for very understandable reasons. Bannock was buried. And there's a discount Ego of the Living God person who's telling Quan that there's a monster coming, which it's got to be the Flood. If it's the Flood, I'll be happy. If it's not the Flood, then I don't see the point in any of this. And I'm just going to start crying. But now we're shifting our attention to Onyx in the development of Ackerson's little Spartan 3 program, which I'm very excited to delve into. So with all that being said, your reaction to Onyx starts now. It's time to pay them back. <laughs> hey, yo. Perez is a Spartan? When did this happen? First squad. Oh. This is a simulation, isn't it? Dude, this is sick! Oh my god! Uh, I wish there was more purple in this ship, though. Is that a commando? Oh! That's 100% a commando. Damn, what's a simulation? Is it because I was on reach and you weren't? Hmm. How did she get here? How did she know to go to Onyx? Red Earth. Damn, they're really putting this propaganda out there thinking he's dead. Then placed upon thin upon. This is like Hunt the Truth. Packaged. Perhaps the largest human he'd ever seen. Oh! <laughs> it's not possible. I mean, this is cool and all, but like, how did he know to go to Onyx? How did Perez know to go to Onyx? Do they just know that's like the next planet that is like Reach? <laughs> Why were it's we just here? like the war games. That's so cool. Yeah, I need to know we're not sending them on a suicide mission. Did you ever ask? Oh, hundred percent, you are. They don't have any of the uh, augmentations and stuff. They yeah, are not yeah. of the same caliber. Onyx. Okay, so Halsey Okay, that makes sense now. And Quan's got to lay off those drugs, bro. You don't have your armor. Go get your son. He's gonna go get his armor back. <laughs> bro, why is she mean mugging? Who <laughs> those SMGs? Oh, it's another one of those wells. Like the hole from Rick and Morty. Hey, a grav lift. I'm flattered. You ruined my best work. <laughs> Before you. Oh, it's the mark of the heretic, bro. He just keeps doing it over and over again. He's rebranding himself. That's insane. A jackal. Is that a female elite? Or is it just a priest? Oh. Yo. That was cool. That was one of the coolest things the show's done. Introduce a Senghili like that. Yeah, no shit. Reminds me of Ready Player One a little bit. Blow up. What do we do now? Get the hell out of here. Beginning of She's Paris, watching for someone. You waiting on another medal? Where are they? Dude, they hiding. <laughs> but where was the covenant? Something's not right. Take the wind, Corporal. Oh. Because that should blow up the ship and they're not expecting them to come back alive so they wouldn't have to deal with enemies. Oh. Chief was able to take down, what, four ODSTs? 
He got this. <laughs> Let, let's go. Oh! I was about to say, girl's taking down four ODSCs. He was like 14. An hour ago. I'm sorry. Oh. I didn't want to show it to you. And it appears now that they are working together. No. <laughs> what? No, they can't. Now I'm going to tell you something, and this information is highly classified. Uh oh. We know the Covenant is able to exfiltrate the other artifact before the planet fell. Hmm. And he's gonna use that. Oh my God, Acton's story. That the position of I suppose that's as good a guess as any. Do you mock me? <laughs> you do know what will become of me if I can't guess. Find... Dude, Cortana better be just manipulating her. And what do you her. suppose will become of you? Something changed. Well, you were shot in the chest, so yes. I don't know. Something between us. Then don't ask me to trust you. Yeah, Cortana really is. Not to. Tana really is manipulating her. They already wrote him off. Changed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why is she? <laughs> right. Ooh. Bro, that's Kai. Believing me means seeing them for what they are. That's a good line. And he's right. I gotta take you in, Chief. Oh, she's squaring up to the chief. Okay. The chief without Mjolnir versus Kai with Mjolnir. This will be interesting. I guess not. Oh. I just didn't know it. Mm. Oh. I know what I am. Just a smart act, Kai. Where do you begin? That's a good line, too. God! This is over, John. Ah! Oh! Well, she definitely did it. And a million more is what we need to win. This is your program. Nope, you just need six months and one Spartan. You made it. Particularly now. And I wouldn't worry about it. One way to put it. It's not a UNSC frequency. That's a Cortana? Outside our spectrum, high volume. Here. Oh, what the hell? Yes, Master Chief. Something terrible is about to happen. Oh, yeah? I'm with the one they call the Arbiter. Oh! oh we killed oh, Benick. <laughs> hey, Cortana. Dude, she's literally in two places at once. That is awesome. When will the Covenant fleet arrive at your location? You've done well. We are in your debt. Yeah, no, you're not. Nothing can be undone. She's in three Another places person. at once. Cortana's awesome. Oh, Miranda. That's where she's been. Halsey. Oh my God, she doesn't know about her dad. The halo? Ah! You gave them my research. To all of us. Without your research, I never would have been able to discover your mistake. Ooh. Sorry. What is this place? Training camp. You don't gotta touch it. See, she's about to figure out, like, that's a suicide mission. The Javelin team completed the sim today. You see? I oh, and the torpedo. Would. It was just a matter of time. And after they planted the spike, is what you have given them. I honestly think that they're just gonna like blow the ship up or something. And what did you give the people on Reach? What are you? A remembrance. Initiate simulation one for that. You let the whole planet burn. Uh, what was Ackerson supposed to do? They all would have died. Well, I've sent in the Black Ops to finish what you. Damn. The Black Ops. This will be interesting. Man, that sounds like uh, terminals in Halo. He's smirking. Let's go, Cortana. See, Chief with Cortana is goaded. <laughs> 
soundtrack going crazy right now. Uh-oh. Bro, what did he do? You gotta kill the priest. She's an instigator, bro. Yo, he's 100% gonna get the priest. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the arbiter, the goat. Dude, it's like a civil war going on. Don't end there, bro. Are you serious? Don't end there. <laughs> bro, are you serious? That was a pretty good episode, though. That was a pretty good episode. There you all go. There is my reaction to Onyx. A very good episode. Definitely far better than episode five. I had a very, very good time enjoying this episode. And I'm glad that it really did feel like the Halo extended universe in many ways. This really did feel like an Oni centric episode. And Oni is the boogeyman when it comes to the Halo universe. And I absolutely love that they're really leaning into that story because Oni has such a rich and compelling narrative that ties into so many different aspects of the Halo universe. And I really am really glad that we're starting to line up to the events of Combat Evolved and getting to the Halo. I really hope that they don't just make it to where, oh, it's just Halo. There's no seven other installations, eight if you count what happens at the end of Combat Evolved. It's convoluted, but you, you all know what I'm saying. I really hope that they go into the idea of there being more Halos. I like the idea, which I kind of figured to begin with, um, Cortana manipulating the Covenant and trying to create this like pseudo great schism uh, within the fleet of the Arbiter. So, and I know this isn't Thelvan Ambar Arbiter, but I am really starting to like his character and him to come into his own as an elite and as a Sankili warrior. And I really like that we're exploring different sides of Sankili culture that we've never seen in the games. This is a really cool step that I think the show does very good of expanding the universe while also staying true to the canon, essentially. It's nice to, Take, take The Last of Us show, for example. You have, in the games, Bill and Frank, right? And you spend about an hour or two with those characters in the game, and it's very off and on. You're just doing little side missions. So the show comes in and gives them the same exact story, but told differently. It doesn't change the plot or the canon at all of the game, but it, in a way, elevates it. It makes it better. And I think that including different aspects of Sanghili culture really characterizes the covenant and each species individually and I think that creates a much more interesting narrative and wants the audience to learn more about the covenant and what makes it so interesting. That whole opening with the Spartan 3 is in the simulation it, it's really telling what Parangoski and Anderson or sorry Anderson Ackerson want to do with this program. It seems like Ackerson truly cares about his Spartans and wants to make them the best they can be. And Parangoski is kind of the other side of that coin where she's like, nah, fuck it, kill them. Just send them all. Operation Torpedo their asses. So it's going to be really interesting to see what they do considering the story with Perez and whatnot. So there's a lot more I want to talk about because that's just scratching the surface of the episode. That's not even going to any like major spoilers or anything because I want to wait until we see how the last two episodes accumulate this story i know that pablo did mention that the penultimate episode which is next episode is crazy it's going to be a really good episode and i'm very excited to see what he means by that and see how that carries into the finale and hopefully season three we haven't seen any news of it being renewed i don't see why it wouldn't halo i believe is number four in viewership when it comes to Paramount, if I'm not mistaken, number four, number three. So I, I do hope they do get renewed. I am enjoying this show thoroughly. And I guess with all that being said, I will see you guys in my episode or my penultimate reaction to Halo the series, season two. Subscribe to Zang Helios for some more un-freaking-believable content.